Hello everyone, welcome back to Hotline Topics. She has massive crowd welcome Ms. Aibe into her new husband's hometown as her husband gets honored. In the midst of all those controversies, Ms. Aibe and her new husband travel down to her husband's hometown. In spite of all the controversies, Mercy seems to be totally unbothered. On getting to the town, a massive crowd welcomed Mercy Aibe. The MC could be heard saying, Mercy Aibe welcome our wife in Uru land. She's our beauty. She's our property. She's our wife. Welcome to Uru town. Then she proceeded to reach the king and then have a seat. And her husband, Mr. Kazim Adjoti, had a case, was honored with an award, Award of Excellence. And Mercy shared some photos on her official social media platform. And in our words, hearty congratulations to your dame, Kazim Adjoti, or you all deserved the award. To say I'm proud of you is an understatement. You're a good man with a great heart and an awesome forgiving spirit. God will continue to elevate you. You're a huge blessing to your community and I'm more than glad that you're being celebrated by people the way you deserve. Thank you, Bumina, for the awesome reception and the massive love. I was overwhelmed and I'm glad to be part of you. As I earlier reported, there have been massive backlash from Nigerians following the recent interview of Mercy Ebe and her current husband, with media room up. And in fact, her husband's first wife we reacted to that interview. She had an opinion on her official social media platform. This was where she revealed that she was not in any agreement for her husband to have a second wife. And she also went further to make some allegations. But in the interview, Kazim Adyoti specifically stated that he was not separated nor divorced from his first wife as he's still married to her. And she lives in the United States with their kids. They have four kids together, including girls and boys. But then, in contrary to what he said in the interview, his first wife reacted on our social media platform, which has sparked reactions among Nigerians. And in our words, let's get the record straight here. This post is regarding an interview recently going around by Media Room Hub with my soon to be ex husband. In one of the numerous lies, I want you all to know that, in contrary to what Mr. Odioti said, I did not, I will never say to have a second wife in my marriage to him. Kazim, you should stop painting a perfect picture of a marriage. You clearly do not have a me. Uluwa Funsho, Ashiwa Jukuto. You and your side chick can continue with whatever it is you're doing. But never come out to social media degrading me and my children. With your demeaning and childish attitude, I will not stoop to your level of rubbish and stupidity. As for you, Mercy, let's call the crap. We were friends, but the shame and your glam lifestyle will not let you admit it. I've been sleeping with Kazim since your son was only five months old. I introduced you to Kazim as my friend. I called and personally invited you and your ex-husband to the 40th surprise birthday party that I did for my soon-to-be ex-husband. You were a constant friend of my back then. I brought you clothes as a friend because I liked you. But you paid me by sleeping with my husband, Kazim. You were a problem in my marriage for years. Now I'm happy to let you know this is only the beginning of the end for you. I'm done. It's all yours. Enjoy. I'm really past this. Like I said in my first post, losing someone who does not respect or appreciate you is actually a game and not a loss. Thank you all. For those who may ask who is Messi IB, or for those who may want to know more about this actual history we are talking about and has been in the midst of this controversy, please stay with us. She's an award-winning actress, filmmaker and the producer who is best known for acting in urban movies. She's also an entrepreneur, brand influencer, and the founder of Miss Ibi Gentry School of Drama. She also owns an Ashwabi store, skincare store, and a fashion store. She was on the 1st of January 1978 in their two states to Paibi and Mrs. Abisola Grace Wooduni as the second child of three children. She had a primary education at St. Francis Primary School and secondary school education at Maryland Campus Secondary School in the Keto part of Lagos State. After her secondary school education, she went on to obtain an OND in financial studies from the Polytechnic of Ibadan in Oyo State. Mercy also has a degree in theatre at from the University of Lagos. She was once married to Larry Gentry and they are blessed with a son. She became known in Nollywood in the year 2006 with the movie era. Before then, she had always wanted to act, but she didn't know how to, but she didn't know how to go about it professionally until her OND days. This was when it became a big deal to her. As a result of this, in 2001, she went on to study theatre arts at the University of Lagos so that she could become a professional actor. As her acting, she's also a businesswoman with diverse sources of income. She has a fashion store called Magdiverse Boutique, which she launched in November 2014. 
She also has a skincare line called Flawless by Mercy and an unshaving store called Ashwabi Mercy. She founded the Max School of Drama at the age of 2016 and the school offers a four months training in acting, script writing, movie making, stage management and so on. Students are said to be under the tutelage of well-trained and experienced instructors who help them build a solid foundation and develop the skills they need to succeed in the highly competitive Nigerian movie industry which is popularly called Nollywood. In the year 2018, in the same month, December, Mercy acquired a mansion and also a Toyota Prado. Some of the movies she has featured in over the years include Satanic, Ara, Afefe Ife, Okonjua, Atunidale, Biraga, Ihamo, Iklese, Irofufu, Mafishiri, Ujife, Omoge Osa as the Leo Kami Victims, the screenplay, Little Jobs of Happy, Flaky Jaya, 77 Bullets, 200 Million, Second Hack, Seven on the Mind, Lagos Will Fake Life, that which binds us, the big fat light, the reunion, just to mention a few of them. Over the years, she has an estimated to be over the years, she has an estimated to be among the richest actors in the industry. And AustinMedia.com gave a net worth figure to be in the sum of six hundred thousand dollars. She's also a multiple award-winning actor with several awards and nominations to her name. Some of her awards and nominations include the City Book Movie Awards for the Best Actress of the Year Yuba category. Fashion Entrepreneur of the Year Award at the Links and Glitz World Awards, Best Actress in the Supporting Way Back at 2010. She was nominated as the Best Actress in an Indigenous Movie, Non English Speaking Category, 2012. Award of Excellence at the Global Leadership Awards for Excellence, Glee 2012. The Best Indigenous Language Uba Category, 2014. Woman of Star at the Mokli Oyu Award, 2014. Yoruba Movie Academy Awards for Emmy nominated Mercy for Best Actress in the League of 2014. City Movie Entertainment Awards honored her as the Yoruba Movie Best Light of the Year 2015. An Entrepreneur of the Year awarded by Links and Glitz World Awards 2015. City Movie Movie Awards nominated Mercy for Best Actress of the Year Yoruba Category in 2016. Role Model Awards at the All Youth Studio Awards 2017. Movie Awards nominated Mercy for Best Supporting Actress in 2018. She was also nominated for Most Searched Actress of the Night Tenders in 2018. Most Popular Actress nominee also of the Night Tenders 2018. Nominated also for the Best Actress in the Supporting Movie Back Category at the Best of Nollywood Awards, Bian Awards 2018. So these are some of our awards and nominations over the years. And we have come to the end of this episode where massive crowd welcome Mercy Ibe into her husband's hometown as they honor her husband and Mercy shuns all the controversies. Please subscribe and hit the bell icon for our daily content.